If you believe you have any information pertaining to this case, you are urged to contact the Los Angeles County Coroner by telephone at 323-343-0512 or by email at info at coroner.lacounty.gov. On the 3rd of January 1971, the headless and handless body of a male was discovered in the Angeles National Forest, near the intersection of the Interstate 5 and the California State Highway 14, in Newhall, Los Angeles County, California. I have been unable to locate his cause and manner of death, or his exact post-mortem interval, though his death appeared relatively recent. The decedent was of Caucasian and or Hispanic descent and was thought to be somewhere between 19 and 25 years old, standing at about 5 feet 8 inches tall and weighing about 150 pounds, with brown body hair and numerous tattoos. I know that the images I'm showing of his tattoos are blurry, I apologise, but they're the highest quality I could find. Found with the decedent was a religious medal. According to the Doe Network, it is believed that his tattoos and his medal are related to Santeria, an Afro-American religion that was developed in Cuba. Due to this, it's thought that he may have been Cuban. There is some online speculation as to whether he could have been one of Randy Stephen Kraft's early victims. The majority of Kraft's victims were Caucasian males in their late teens or early twenties, and this unidentified decedent fits that criteria. Kraft often dismembered or mutilated his victims, and this man was dismembered, his head and hands removed. Also, Kraft was known to operate in California, the state in which this man was found. Of course, this is pure speculation. It's entirely possible that he didn't fall victim to Randy Kraft. It's not even certain that he was a homicide victim. As I said, I've been unable to locate his cause and manner of death. In my opinion, at least, this seems suspicious, given that he was dismembered. Though, again, I'm not privy to any insider information. I'm not law enforcement or anything, so don't take my word as fact. Alas, this is all the information I've been able to glean. Thank you to Gen Kaneshiro for suggesting that I cover this case. I'd actually never heard of this man before you left your comment. I'm sorry that this video is so short. Again, there's next to no information about this man available online. I did what I could with what I could find. Again, if you believe you have any information pertaining to this case, you are urged to contact the Los Angeles County Coroner by telephone at 323-343-0512 or by email at info at coroner.lacounty.gov. Thank you very much for giving Newhall John Doe's case a moment of your day.